all, welcome to make 2 explore channel. First of all, thank you to all our subscribers, viewers and supporters. In this video, we are going to run different media pipe ML solutions, examples, on, Raspberry Pi 4 board. Like, face detection, face mesh, hands and pose estimation, holistic tracking, hair segmentation, box tracking, objectron, etc. But before going forward, if you want to replicate these solutions at your desk, then you need to install MediaPi Python package on your Raspberry Pi. So, for that, we have separate video tutorials, in which, we have explained, step by step in detail, about, how to configure, and, optimize the performance of your Raspberry Pi, for vision-based projects. And in other tutorial, we have also explained, how to install Media Pipe package on Raspberry Pi. Check them out. Links are shared in description box. Okay, now we will see how to run different Media Pipe ML solutions supported in Raspberry Pi. By the word supported means, among all Media Pipe solutions. Not all solutions works on Raspberry Pi. But most of them works. And few of them not yet supported. Let me show you by going to MediaPipe website. Here you can see there are several solutions. But those which have green ticks only works with Python, means in Raspberry Pi-like devices. So you can see here, we can run Python solutions like face detection, face mesh, hands, pose, holistic, selfie segmentation, and objectron. The Python codes for all these solutions are given here. You can tweak with them. Let me show you. Go to the documentation of this face detection solution. You can read here an overview that MediaPipe face detection is an ultra-fast face detection solution that comes with six landmarks and multi-face support. It is based on Blaze Face, a lightweight and well-performing face detector. Down here, they have given the configuring options of solution APIs. Model selection option is for selecting faces detection within 2 to 5 meters from the camera. The next, you can also change minimum detection confidence value. From 0.0 to 1.0, likewise. Okay, going forward, down here in Python code, you can change those values, as per your choice. So, this was about configuration options of face detection solution. The next, let's see configuration of one more MediaPipe ML solution, that is Objectron. So here, you can see, MediaPipe Objectron is a mobile, real-time 3D object detection solution for everyday objects. It detects objects in 2D images, and estimates their poses through a machine learning model, trained on the Objectron dataset. For this solution, configurable options are static image mode, maximum number of objects to detect, minimum detection confidence, etc. One interesting config is the model name. Here you can choose name of the model to use for predicting 3D bounding box landmarks. Currently it only supports shoe, chair, cup, and camera. You can tweak and play with this. Here is the Python code. Here they have given default model as shoe, we can change it as cup or chair. We will see this in demo session. So, in this way, you can go through all these solutions, which are very well documented, with theory and coding in different programming languages. Okay, now we will switch over to our Raspberry Pi desktop, where we have already loaded these solutions in Thony Python IDE. We will run them one by one. Just follow along. We will share all the codes on our GitHub. Links will be in description box. Before going to demo session, let's take quick look at the hardware setup, which we have used for running MediaPipe solutions on Raspberry Pi. Here we used Logitech 270 webcam. Our Pi is also connected to LCD monitor through mini HDMI cable. Okay, this is all about hardware setup, let's jump over to our Pi desktop session. Like a 
So, in this way, we have completed this tutorial. In next videos, we will see some projects using Media Pipe framework. Such as gesture controlled presentation, mouse pointer control, robot control, etc. Using Raspberry Pi hardware. Stay tuned for more updates. If you face any difficulty in replicating this DIY tutorial, feel free to ping us on Telegram, or you can also send us email at info at the rate make to explore.com. We would be happy to help. Thank you.